Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this now is exponential equation solution from here. And what we have here, which is 5 raised to pi x plus 5 raised to pi x plus 5 raised to pi x equals to 50. We can factor 5 raised to pi x out here, and we have 5 raised to pi x into brackets 1 plus 1 plus 1 left here equals to 50 on this side. Then this is the same thing as 5 raised to the power x times 1 plus 1 plus 1, that's 3, equals to 50 from here. But this here, yeah, we divide both sides by 3. Divide this side by 3. Also divide this side by 3. Here, yeah, 3 cancel each other. And we have 5 raised to the power x equals to 50 over 3 here. Then here we take the log on both sides. As this here we have log 5 raised to the power x equals to log 50 over 3 here. Then we apply the power law of log room here. Now we have log n raised to the power p. Do the same thing as p log m. At this here we have x log 5 equals to log 50 over 3 here then this also follows when we have log a over b which can be expressed as log a minus log b that is here yeah, this becomes x log 5 equals to log 50 minus log 3 then here we step we divide both sides by log 5 divide this side by log 5 also divide this side by log 5 that this here log 5 cancelled each other we have x equals to log 50 minus log 3 over log 5 then next step here we separate this into two fractions we have x equals to log 50 over log 5 minus log 3 over log 5 that is from here 50 can be written as 5 times 10 which implies we have x equals to log 5 times 10 over log 5 minus log 3 over log 5. This also follows log logarithm. When we have log a times b, this same thing as log a plus log b. At this here we have x equals to log 5 plus log 10 over log 5 minus log 3 over log 5. Then here we separate this into two fractions. This becomes x equals to log 5 over log 5 plus log 10 over log 5 minus log 3 over log 5 that is log 5 here can switch other we have one left that is x equals to 1 plus log 10 over log 5 minus log 3 over log 5 that is also 10 can be expressed as 5 times 2 then this becomes x equals to 1 plus log 5 times 2 over log 5 minus log 3 over log 5 then 
Here, yeah, this also follows the law of logarithm, and we have x equals to 1 plus log 5 plus log 2 over log 5 minus log 3 over log 5. Then, we separate this into two fractions. We have x equals to 1 plus log 5 over log 5 plus log 2 over log 5 minus log 3 over log 5 that is also here log 5 cancel each other we have one left and this becomes x equals to 1 plus 1 as 2 and plus log 2 over log 5 minus log 3 over log 5. Then next step here, we apply change of base. And when we have log A over log B, which is the same thing as log A to base B. That is, here we have x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 5 minus log 3 base 5 that is the value of x here that's 2 plus log 2 base 5 minus log 3 base 5 let's check here if this satisfies this given problem that is we substitute the value of x here which is x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 5 minus log 3 base 5 that is what we have here becomes 5 raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 5 minus log 3 base 5 plus also 5 raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 5 minus log 3 base 5 plus also 5 raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 5 minus log 3 base 5 is it equals to 50 on this side then from here follows when we had same thing together a plus a plus a that's same thing as 3 times a and what we have here also can be written as 3 times 5 raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 5 minus log 3 base 5 is it equals to 50 on this side then this follows law of indices when we have a raised to power n plus n is same thing as a raised to power n times a raised to power n and also a raised to power n minus n, same thing as a raised to power n over a raised to power n. That is, we can write this and we have 3 times 5 raised to power 2 times 5 raised to power log 2 base 5 over 5 raised to power log 3 base 5. This is equals to 50 on this side. Then, here yeah, we have 3 times 5 squared, that's 25, times a follows and we have a raised to power log b to base a, which is equals to b. At this a we have 2 over 3 here. Yeah. Is it equals to 50 on this side? At this a, yeah, this 3 counts each other. We have 25 times 2. Is it equals to 50 on this side? And of course, 25 times 2, that's 50. Which is equals to 50 from here left hand side is equals to the right hand side and therefore x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 5 minus log 3 base 5 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comment see you next class and bye for now